it's a kind of simple prediction, I guess. Um, if this model has any validity, I'd expect to see a spectrum of this disorder from very dysfunctional to access to some functionality and everything in between. And because one of the key causal elements is our own hormones, um, the steroidal hormones, particularly testosterone, and because that's produced in greater quantity in males, I'd expect males to be more afflicted than females. And then within that, I'd expect a spectrum of symptoms going from you know, relatively mild, uh, minor affliction to relatively severe. And at the more severe end, you're looking at pretty much total left hemisphere dominance, very little access to the right hemisphere, a world built on concepts with very little empathy, compassion, pr probably zero. Um, but going hand in hand with that, as with all mental ill health, a lot of fear, um, paranoia, fear, a lot of need to be in control. So the symptoms predict that th those, with the most, uh, those with the most severe symptoms will want to take power. And generally they do, often through aggressive means. And then they end up creating societies in the image of the very dysfunctional left hemisphere and imposing that on everybody else which actually tends to exacerbate this, this situation. We end up creating a culture that tends to encourage the left hemisphere. Rational education, constantly encouraging the traits the left hemisphere thinks are advanced. So almost encouraging the pathology to take dominance earlier and earlier and create more systems that encourage that. Um, and that's exactly what we seem to have. You know, a very hierarchical, patriarchal system that has very little in the sense of humanity or empathy or compassion convinced that it's highly advanced and doing exactly what it needs to do. This isn't anybody's fault. I'm not really talking about individuals here. I'm just talking about the spectrum of the, of the symptoms I'd expect to see. Older males taking control and without any, any um, access to the right hemisphere in terms of compassion or empathy creating hell on earth, basically.